According to Mayo Clinic, Seasonal Affective Disorder, or SAD, is a form of depression which typically is most prominent within the fall and winter months. According to Global Post, college students may notice a decrease in academic performance, feelings of wanting to stay in bed and skip class, desire to eat comfort food, and minor body aches. According to WebMD, SAD can happen to anyone, but population where it is more commonly seen is in women, people aged 15 to 55, if a family member has suffered from SAD, and those who live far away from the equator. Research has not determined a clear cause, but a lack of sunlight has been shown to disrupt serotonin release. I think I'm getting more used to it this year. I'm from Southern California, so last year making the move out here definitely was something that I noticed affected me in like wanting to be active or doing some of the things I regularly do. Mm -hmm. uh, in the winter time I definitely feel way less motivated to study or play music or do anything than I feel like I normally want to do, especially in the summertime I feel a lot more up to doing it I guess. So this morning when I woke up and it was bright and sunny, I was like hey I'm gonna go for a run. When it's pouring rain outside and cloudy like this, I tend to not feel like that in the morning. You have to, I guess, debate whether it's worth going all the way from upper campus, you know, from lower campus because of how cold it is or how rainy it is. So, I guess that's how it's affected me personally. Okay, like around five o'clock, it feels like it's nine o'clock to me. So I'm like, why am I so tired? The good news is that clinical treatment usually isn't needed and some small changes have been shown to help, such as adding some more color to your dorm room, interacting with others on campus, or being physically active. This is Sierra with Trevor Whitney reporting for Mast Media.